What's up, everybody? This is Hector Tech Preacher. So Google usually dropped a new operating system of Android in September, October, usually when the new Pixel come out. And Pixels is the one that showcased the new operating system. But we always get previews and developer preview versions months in advance. Uh, also, we get beta versions months in advance. Well, Google strangely dropped a bill, a early bill of Android 13, and I installed it on my Google Pixel 6. So let me give you my thoughts about it. Sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. So Android 12 and Android 12L is the biggest change yet for the operating system. I'm telling you, I like the direction that Google is going in with their new operating system. And again, we haven't got the final bill and the final release of Android 12L yet, uh, and it's coming out very soon, but it seems strange that Google released the developer preview of Android 13. So I installed it on my Google Pixel 6, and I wanna give you guys my thoughts here about it. Now, it's not a lot going on here, but still, Android 13 on the Google Pixel, months and months and months early in advance, so let's talk about it. First, a disclaimer here. This bill is not for people that's using their devices as a daily driver. This bill is a very buggy bill and is a very early bill. Now, betas is not out yet. So if you wanted to install Android 13 on your device, you have to side load it using ADB from your computer. Uh, so that's something that you definitely got to keep in mind that this is a very early preview bill and the betas are not even out yet. So if you wanted to install Android 13 on your device, just make sure that the device that you're installing it on is not your daily driver. Okay, so since we got all the prelims out the way, first thing is uh, about this new build of Android 13 is now we know the name, uh, the name of this of Android 13 is gonna be called Tiramisu. As you know, with Android 12, it was called Snow Cone, and Android 12L was called Snow Cone version two. Uh, so in this build, it's more like Android 12L that I talked about in my previous video, with a light, slight change in material you design. Uh, some changes here, not that much right now, uh, but let's talk about a change that I did see here uh, with this device. So one of the changes that I did see is in wallpaper and styles. Now you have a new toggle that's called theme icons and now you have access to your dog theme in the same place and you have a app grid here also. So it looks like Google is planning to have all of the look and feel of your device in this one area. Now as far as performance, again, I'm seeing a shorter and higher refresh rate when it comes down to opening and closing apps. Uh, again, it looked like Google is going for a cleaner user-friendly OS with Android 12L and Android 13. So it gives you more of a personal look with Material U. And I, I really do like the direction that Google is going in here. Look, I can't wait to see what's next. You know, I will be making a bunch of videos about Android 12L and Android 13, so stay tuned. So having Android 13 right now, my Google Pixel 6 performance has been really good. Now you do have the usual app crashes and the poor battery life as I talked about in my Android 12L. Uh, the UI crashes is all across the board. And again, this is a early build. So I wouldn't recommend it to anybody that's gonna use the device as a daily driver. So this is Android 13 developers preview the very first one way months and months in advance so i'm going to keep you guys updated with everything else in between uh with android 13 and android 12 l i'm gonna make a lot of videos about it so stay tuned and subscribe this is eric the tech preacher from easy computer solutions let's have some fun with android 13 tiramisu baby let's have some fun see you guys on the next video peace